and welcome back to the channel now this video is our Memorial Day 2023 ride as we cruise around on Memorial Day hope you're having a great Memorial weekend wherever you may be Thank you for coming along on the ride. On this ride, I'm just going to talk a little bit about the YouTube channel that I started back on 4th of July 2022. So it's coming up on one year in about another five weeks. And, uh, it's, uh, become uh, quite the thing for myself I mean I started out as doing this as a hobby um, and did not expect it to do as well as it's doing and also I was not expecting to put as much time into it as I ended up and am doing now uh, so but I'm really enjoying it and I'm devoting a lot more time like I say than I ever thought I would and I knew I was passionate about bikes that's why I got into this kind of but uh, I didn't know how passionate I would be being on YouTube but it's turned out turned out to be a lot of fun and I really enjoy doing it so uh, we'll look forward to year number two and see uh, where we take it from here so hopefully we can expand and grow There's been some rough patches along the way, things that have come up. Uh, uh, and you live and learn from them. And uh, I'm learning a, a lot as we go here. Um, about the channel and I'm still learning um, and I'll continue to learn but it's a lot of fun thank you very much to all the subscribers as we uh, are approaching the 1,000 subscribers and At the same time, we're approaching, as I say, the one year anniversary of the channel, so. But we've had a few guests along the way. We've met some people along our rides. And. I hope that we continue to do just that. Meet more new people, get more people on the channel and also meet people on our rides and uh, hopefully they get interested and uh, get themselves an e-bike and join the e-bike family so in my uh, time with the channel I mean I started out with the Rad Rover 4 long before I got the channel then just before I started up the channel it was pr partly because of this the uh, getting the aerial rider grizzly but after I had it for a bit I thought you know it would be kind of fun to shoot some video riding around on it and so that's how I got into it 
and since then we've got the bike that I'm on right now the Air Graffiti and we're gonna see what else comes down the road Uh, when I say there's been some uh, bumps along the road, one of the uh, things that I'm meaning by that is uh, some uh, uh, challenging weather, shall we say. But even during those challenge challenging weather times, we still were able to persist and get videos up on the channel I've done uh, some rides in the uh, snow and ice rain wind we've pretty much covered it all I have not ridden in a tornado nor will I but that that's an extreme that nobody should be riding in but I mean other than that we've been riding in some uh, adverse weather for sure but also there's a lot of beautiful days like today it's just beautiful so uh, I just wanted to uh, by riding in those conditions just show you that it is possible <clears throat> that you can ride your bike uh, in some not so great weather It's not recommended, but it's doable, is I guess the way I would put it. The uh, trickiest of all of that is when you get an ice storm and you try riding on the ice. That That is <clears throat> really risky. You gotta take it easy, go really slow. The only way I would do that kind of a ride too would be as I have with fat tires if I had a narrow tire bike there's no way I would ever do that I wouldn't be riding on with a inch and a half wheel or something you know and getting out there and, and riding there's no way but with the fat tires I do feel safer Just take it easy, go slow, uh, take your time, you'll get there, and the rain, the trick with that is uh, you need to have something uh, protecting your eyes. You need definitely eye protection because otherwise can't see where you're going and I've done that before I've ridden in rain and didn't have no eye protection and uh, been squinting the whole time and you don't want to be doing that even squinting didn't uh, didn't really work that well because I still would have uh, uh, rain getting into your eyes and it makes it basically impossible pretty much to see and it can be dangerous too when you can't see where you're going but I'm looking forward to the uh, year number two coming up here as I say we're about to hit our one year birthday and year two is going to be a fun year and I'm looking forward to what's coming up I have no idea yet I can't even give you any hints or little teases or anything because I don't know myself yet uh, what's going to uh, what's going to be next. But there'll be something. I just don't know what yet.
like this bike, and I've said it time and time again, but it is an absolute joy to be riding the Lyric Graffiti. This bike uh, exceeded what I thought it would be like to ride. And uh, I mean, I couldn't, right from day one, I couldn't believe it. I thought, wow, this is going to be a fantastic bike to, to uh, be riding on. And uh, right from day one, I did a video back at the time. I did the unboxing video, and then I did the first ride impression. And that was literally my first time getting on the bike and riding it. So I wanted to take the uh, camera along and, and make sure I uh, documented it um, so everybody could see the very first ride on the bike. And that was it. I didn't even do a two second, you know, quick ride around the neighborhood, around the corner or anything. I just waited. Uh, got the battery, made sure it was charged up, ready to go, and and uh, off we went. So if you want to check back uh, and watch that first ride, it is the Lyric Graffiti first uh, ride impression. Back about three and a half months ago. Approximately now. I think a lot of people bolted for the uh, long weekend. Headed for the coast. Well, that's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, thank you. Uh, just hit that subscribe button. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified that the next video is up. And also, if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, on the channel just go ahead and leave a comment in the comments below i do my best to try to get to as many of them as i can so once again thank you for joining me on this memorial day ride 2023 and until next time take care